like to share with you the story of a very special man who loved to bike. And this story was told to me recently by the man's wife. His name was Tracy H. Logan. And Tracy Logan lived in Yellow Springs from 1969 until his death earlier this year. He was 84. He loved a lot of things about bicycling, but he especially loved children. And there was nothing that Tracy loved better than watching the kids get on their bikes and ride off for a bike trip. He believed cars were harmful to the environment and world, uh, our environment and world peace. And he almost never rode in cars. For him, a car was for a medical emergency or for carrying a canoe. He <laughs> rode bikes and he walked. And he but he loved all aspects of bicycling, and it was Tracy Logan that did so much to get Yellow Springs to be a bike-friendly city, village, town. <laughs> he researched proper construction of bike paths. He helped make bike racks that don't wreck your tires. He put together and maintained a set of community bikes you could hop on where you found them and ride them till you got off. He led regular Sunday bike trips for families and Wednesdays for seniors. And he mapped out 15 different bike trips you could take around Yellow Springs. And in fact, according to his daughter Amy, Tracy was the first to put a milk crate on the back of his bike. <laughs> and with all this, he may best be known by your parents, grandparents, uncles, aunts, for the free bike clinic that he ran on Saturday so you could learn to fix your own bike. Tracy would tell you step by step how to fix it but he would never do it for you. <laughs> he did all this as long as he was able. In the last year, he had to ride in a car, but that's all right. Tracy really liked that you Mills Lawn students got to participate in a bike hike, and if he would say something to you now, I think he'd say, you are precious, you are a gift to the world, and the world is a gift to you. Love yourself and love the world. Do what you love and do what you believe in. Make a difference if you can. But whatever you do, do your best and know that it is enough because you are precious. Now, as mayor, I am issuing a proclamation. Whereas today is the seventh national walk and bike to school day with over 2,530 schools around our country participating, including our very own Mills Line. Whereas walking and biking to school promote healthy habits, cleaner environment, teaches safety, provides many benefits to the community. Whereas the Village Council of Yellow Springs had stated as one of its goals that Yellow Springs should become a walkable, cyclable community, and it's the judgment of the Bike Enhance Committee, the Village has achieved that goal. Whereas Yellow Springs resident Tracy H. Logan, Jr., who lived in Yellow Springs with his family until 1969, until his death on February 25th of this year, he was the model of an avid cycling enthusiast and ambassador who did so much to encourage the habit of bicycling in our village, biking for fun, biking for transportation. Now, therefore, in recognition of Mills Lawn School celebrating Walk and Bike to School Day and in deep appreciation for all that Tracy H. Logan did for our community, I, Pam Canine, as Mayor of Yellow Springs, hereby proclaim Wednesday, May 9, 2018, as Tracy H. Logan, Jr. Walk and Bike to School Day! Yay!